Okay. The company has four different lines of tobacco, which is light, it's called air, which is average, it's called water, which is medium, it's called earth and fire, which is really strong. We only have two lines, sadly, which is water and earth. For the air, earth, and water lines, they use uh, Virginia tobacco. The good point that heat resistance, it doesn't have any debris, it's clean leaves. The tobacco itself is pretty good one. Give you long smoke if you pack properly. If you're not gonna pack it properly, you're probably not even gonna get any smoke out of it. The bad point, I think it's the price. This is a 200 grams. It's about $20 in the United States. It's kind of costly. Enough talking, let's try to pack it. Let's try to smoke it. Let's try to get as much smoke as we can out of it. We're gonna see what's going on with that. Today, we're gonna try Moro's flavor, Fijoa, pineapple, and pear. In my opinion, one of the best flavors of element, it's called Moro's. The good point, you don't have to add ice in your base and you don't have to put hose and refrigerator to get that cold feeling when you smoke you can just add a little bit of moros if you're going to be using upgrade type of bowl i would recommend to dry tobacco a little bit before you pack in because you're going to get a lot of juice in your base for this type of tobacco we're going to be using funnel style bowl you don't have to dry tobacco all right let's try it that's a pier let's do fijoa right now what you want to do you want to shake it before putting it inside your bowl because you'll get that fluffiness of the tobacco oh, let's add pineapple all right and that's some moros flavor you want to take just a little bit just like that maybe it's you know, too much somewhere over here is a bit good and right now what you want to do is just make it a little, little bit more evenly but you don't have to press it so you're just gonna leave it fluffy as you can all right, let's put it up. We put three charcoals, heat management. Now we have to wait a couple of minutes and uh, we're gonna try it. Somebody recommended me to try put four charcoals and let it stay for 10 minutes. I'm not gonna do it because it's just gonna burn it down. Put three charcoals, I'm gonna wait two minutes instead of 10. While we're waiting, I'm gonna tell you, we tried different type of bowls and uh, on some of them, you won't get any smoke. Even if you put four charcoals, I don't know, maybe my hands out of my ass, but all right, let's give it a try. All right, it's going, it's going. Let's uh, give it another try. It's been uh, five minutes. Well, as far as the flavor going, I like it. The flavor is really good. It gives you good taste of uh, those flavors which you put. As far as the uh, smoke output, it's not really well, but you have to wait a little bit more to get more smoke. We're not gonna be waiting, we're just gonna be smoking. <laughs> All right, it's been uh, more than five minutes, three charcoals. Let's give it a try. As far as the uh, taste is good, as far as the smoke, it's good. We tried the same flavor a couple of days ago on the same bowl. After one hour smoking, you still can get the same taste as you get at the beginning. Normal. 